Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Matthew chapter 6, beginning at verse 1 and ending at verse 14. This is the Amplified Version. Giving to the poor and prayer. Be very careful not to do your good deeds publicly to be seen by men. Otherwise, you will have no reward prepared and awaiting you with your Father who is in heaven. So whenever you give to the poor and do acts of kindness, do not blow a trumpet before you to advertise it, as the hypocrites do, like actors acting out a role in the synagogues and in the streets, so that they may be honored and recognized and praised by men. I assure you and most solemnly say to you, they already have their reward in full. But when you give to the poor and do acts of kindness, do not let your left hand know what your right hand is doing. Give in complete secrecy so that your charitable acts will be done in secret and your father who sees what is done in secret will reward you. Also, when you pray, do not be like the hypocrites for they love to pray publicly standing in the synagogues and on the corners of the streets so that they may be seen by men. I assure you and most solemnly say to you, they already have their reward in full. But when you pray, go into your most private room, close the door and pray to your father who is in secret and your father who sees what is done in secret will reward you. And when you pray, do not use meaningless repetition as the Gentiles do, for they think they will be heard because of their many words. So do not be like them praying as they do, for your Father knows what you need before you ask Him. Pray then in this way, Our Father who is in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we have forgiven our debtors, letting go of both the wrong and the resentment. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. For if you forgive others their trespasses, their reckless and willful sins, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive others, nurturing your hurt and anger with the result that it interferes with your relationship with God, then your Father will not forgive your trespasses. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.